there, laddies. Uh, I'm gonna show you what to do when you have a freaking root aphid infestation, as I experienced for the first time in my life. But uh, do your research, learn about them, learn how they live, learn how they fuck, learn how they eat. But uh, make sure you take care of them, though. It's easier to do it when uh, plants are small, in small containers small pots, that kind of thing. Uh, if you uh, wait, you're pretty much fucked. But uh, you can do it, I guess, with a big pot, but uh, it's going to cost you. But uh, in sense, take your thingamajig, dunk it. Oh, it's not going to work, but <laughs> dunk it in an H2O solution. Uh, yeah, you can pretty much dunk it in straight H2O. It's not going to kill it, but it could. But uh, use a 1 to 10 ratio, give or take 30%. A little bit of soap to suffocate them. Let it sit for half hour. No, not half hour, maybe 10 minutes. Second dunk, dunk number two, in a bug solution. Kind of like this. Uh, I used uh, Bug Be Gone. No oil base. You can use rosemary oil, neem oil, uh, Botanigard, I guess, if you got some PPA money. But... Uh, I don't keep it natural, right? People smoke this. So, uh, so yeah, H2O dunk, bug be gone dunk. Uh, let it sit again for a few minutes. And then your third is just put the nutrients back in. Get your PPMs back in there. Get your pH right. Let it sit. But uh, always make sure you got some good roots before you do this. So it's almost worth it to let it wait a little bit to uh, build your plant so it can survive such a horrendous horrendous uh what do you call it genocide i guess uh call it a lot of things but uh like i said don't judge me but i uh i call myself hitler on days like today but uh not in that sense although he did do some good things but uh yeah you can see you can see all these freaking things down there i know it's kind of tough but ooh, they're all dead fucking root aphids but it does work again uh, I hope this helps. It works for me. And, uh, yeah, right on.